Can we get this again? Oh yeah, we can get this again. Perfect. Anime opening is really good. <laughs> original game came out 2015? 2015 or 2016? And this is a remake that came out like a few days ago. Uh, right, settings. I hope that the audio is fine. I will keep it like this for now. Hey! Did I jump scare you? Yeah, I bet I did. You coward. You make me sick. Your weakness is pathetic. <laughs> Stop. Um. The space not being used? Turn menu escape talk set. Um, let's use F for that, I guess. Yeah, use F. There we go. Should be better. Other place German words that are popular. <laughs> Do you think? Do you think that will happen? All right. Let's uh, go into gaze, I guess. Hold your memories close to your heart. <laughs> yes, it will happen. Okay. Wait, how? What? 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 I do. You should never let go. Do you understand? Yes, mother. <laughs> Where am I? This is a pocket mirror. Yeah, and it's an it's uh this is the remake of apparently one of the best RPG maker horror game. That uh, was supposed to be like the best shit back then, and they made a remake out of it. So I'm gonna figure out why. Why it's so good? Because I have no idea. My pocket mirror. <laughs> Don't worry, I'm also scared when I see myself in the mirror. Welcome to the cum zone. <laughs> I can't see my own reflection. 
I should be happy about that. <laughs> All right. It's closed. I can't get out. It's only seven years. Uh, what was recollect? Oh shit. Okay. Do I have like an items? Q. Okay. Wait. It's my Q button. Wow, I'm pressing Q but nothing happens. Hmm. There's something down there though, like a like a Chris There you go. What was that? A red marble. I honestly unironically love RPG Maker games, especially when I try and really made and they create some new unexpected mechanic. I learned to I actually learned to love RPG Maker games. I always disliked RPG Maker games because it was always that I was most of the time just like this like Final Fantasy type of game and I was like nah. But then I know what to say, a lot of like RPG Maker games are actually not like that. It's most of the time like just a story that's being told. And the stories are most of the time really, really good. So that's why I kind of, I kind of like, I want to play some more RPG Maker games. Just not the ones with like fighting and stuff, I, I can't, but... Are there some? I'm down. A marble? But the one I sent you? I will, I will probably get banned for that one. <laughs> There's no one here. The mob is glowing. Oh, this is how I save? Oh, okay. Well, stuff he sent you. Don't, don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. <laughs> don't worry about it. <laughs> there are a few shallow holes in the ground. I don't know what it does when I like, press the button up there. Be too much. It's locked. <laughs> the doorknob is missing. There's no knob, handle, or keyhole in the door. Oh, Fenric! The doorknob is broken. I can't open it. Damn, we're already stuck, huh? Can I not do something with like the items that I have? Let me see. Inspect shortcut A, shortcut B, use. Oh, this doesn't do much. It's so bright, I can't see anything. Should be already stuck. The keyhole is stuffed with a strange mocky substance. Hmm. Stop knocking on my door, please. It's hanging loosely from its slot. What can I do with like the items that I have? Like I don't think I can use them right now at least. It's closed. So I can't go back either. It won't budge. Oh, okay, okay. I throw the marble in, I guess. It fits. There you go. The doll is so pretty. Why is it in a place like this? A pale porcelain doll sits on the floor, facing the wall. Ec 
ugly yet. I wonder how to do this. Oh, that door moved. Was this here before? The pale blonde doll sits on the floor with a sinister smile on her lips, slowly nodding. These look like they've been drawn by children. What if we like look at this again? No, she didn't change. What is this? As oh, a compass. And she moved again. This all wasn't here before. <laughs> I don't want to approach it. The fragile looking doll grins mischievously, staring into nothing. <laughs> is the audio fine, by the way? Is everything loud enough? Let's put this in here. This doesn't belong in there. How about here? This fits in here. Oh, Angel! Good, that do not. It's hard to breathe in here. What is this? Please forgive me. Please forgive me. It's not my fault. Don't leave me here. Don't leave me. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. These are... Uh... The quill floats eerily, scribbling down on the old scraps of paper. A weeping angel glab claps, clasps its hands in prayers, holding a rosary in between its fingers. Looks like blood. Did you just kill someone? Clapping cheeks. No, that there was no clapping cheeks. <laughs> There's something shining inside. Reach for it, don't rage. Oh, we have to reach for it, right? <laughs> My hand is stuck. Uh oh. Step ghost, I'm stuck. <laughs> Step ghost, I'm stuck, please. A lavender marble. Crimson blood drips from the desktop, slowly pooling on the floor. So I'm guessing this marble goes in here then. It's so pretty, it's a shame it's so dusty. It looks like it has been painted over. The mouth of the teapot overflows with cloudy, grubby mold. Old cobweb cover of the um old cobwebs cover the surface of the stool. Can I no? Like some roses here. A dull yet strong light illuminates the room, peeking through the grimy window. The grimy window. There we go. Miss? Yes, who's there? Tell me, miss, how does the sky look today? Oh, I... It's blue? I don't know. It's raining. I can't see from here. Ah, it's blue? 
right? Well, technically, wait, couldn't really see, right? As blue. I see. Thank you. Here, you can have this. Blue marble. Is there something behind here as well? Oh, there's nothing. I know the feel you see of all and just need to. St of course you do, Wallola, of course. Of course you do. Hey, this door opens again. It's stuck. Force it open. You can eat yourself against the door. See that what happens? That's exactly what happens if you stick stuff in the holes all alone. Get chopped off. <laughs> That's what I come back to. <laughs> the surface of the mirror has been soiled with fresh blood, which drips down its frame and onto the floor. Oh, this is finger. I think we can do something with it. Footprints. Hmm. There's just a finger there, though. See the model. It's closed. I can't get out. Crimson drops hang off the flower's petals. I mean, just pick pick up the the, the the finger, pick it up. Probably need it for something. Illuminated by the sun, between water and fire, I rest in the dark side of the moon, awaiting your awakening. What does it mean? When did this game release? I've been playing this game like a while back. The the OG game was released I sometimes around 2015, 2016, I guess. And this is the remake which came out like a few days ago. 2016. Let's quickly save. I have nothing to put in there. Is that a dark side of the moon? I want to go back in there? Okay. Can't open this one anymore. Hmm. There's something on the window's parapet. Oh, there we go. There's our final piece. Are we summoning Satan now? Maybe my pocket mirror would fit in here. Get your pocket mirror back. I should bring it back with me. Yeah, better pick it up again. Better pick it up. Sh summoning James Carl. <laughs> oh my god. Ah, there's another one. Look at this. Creepy doll. Such a strange doll. There's a big mirror here.
The spines of the books are all scratched out. I can't read their titles. It's a diary. There's something scribbled on the cover. Little goody two shoes. I once lived in a small village when I was young. My youth was spent in a hard labor and cold, sleepless nights. I often dreamt about a better future, one that could fill my stomach with luxurious sweets and thick, expensive steaks. One day, I heard an old woman talking about a strange rumor. She said that a certain someone had been granting wishes in the woods to anyone who dared summon a certain name. Someone who wasn't quite human. I thought humongous. What happened? <laughs> That's blinding me. This fucking heist is a super range of Lolathon. And he got me with that fucking avatar so many times. It's moving like water. Oh. That's us. Oh my fucking god, man. Oh. It looks like just a normal mirror. Is this pumpkin snoring? It's closed shut. The doorknob is stuck. Oh, I can sprint. That's cool. Looking for something? What do you mean? Lolo, why is your snoring on on blurb? She's looking this way. Oh no, look away before you get turned into stone. My hand. Oh, that hurts, I guess. Blinded as sacrifice for those in dismay. Stolen by the just childish play. Right and left taken by the hand. Our request is your demand. I don't think I have that stuff. You snore louder. Oh god. Drawing is based upon perspective, which is nothing more than a thorough knowledge of the function of the eye. Aren't I smart? Rebirth, 1785, the painting of an elderly woman. Do you have a minute to talk about our Lord and Savior, Lightning McQueen? <laughs> Fate, 1655, grasping the dagger buried into her chest, a lady sinks to the bottom of the sea. God damn. Did you know pumpkin flowers are edible? I wouldn't mind having my inside scoop. Excuse me, what? 
I wouldn't mind having my insides scooped out as long as I could become a yummy pumpkin pie. Ah, it's a bit fucked up, isn't it? Satisfaction, 1800. A woman sits on a throne, wrapping her hands around an expressionless small child's neck. Salvation, 1722. The painting of a woman laying in bed, surrounded by representations of death and demons. I don't like painting. <laughs> is this a demo? This is the full version. This is the full game. Star feature films such as Cars, Cars 2, Cars 3, Planes, Fire, Rescue, Rock, Rock of Finding Dory, Toy Story 3 and Roll. <laughs> God damn it. And see what's the demo. Yeah, you can get the demo if you're not sure about buying it. Just a reminder that if you want to support MyZoos, consider checking out Patreon or Toxic MyZoos. Toxic is for the command, man. Punishment 1538, a girl joins her own two hands as her hair burns in crimson flames. What the fuck? Delusion. <laughs> 1760, the painting of an important looking female aristocrat surrounded by various young girls desperately clinging to her. Futile hope. A group of women ride their mounds into battle dressed in long white dresses. Numb, that's me. I'm numb to the pain. Skeleton hands reach out to a lady dancing passionately amongst the flames. And retribution, reunited in a golden room, various smiling women witness the murder of a newborn child by decapitation. Jesus. Exclamation mark toxic is not a command. Well, sitting here listening to you spread misinformation is just gross, especially considering you've been wrong multiple times. <laughs> Any information I gave was correcting your completely made up information or answering someone's question. <laughs> it's funny you get upset when someone makes you look foolish. Night. <laughs> what the fuck? Bridal virgin here. Fair! A ghostly pale girl sits on a well-carved wooden chair wearing nothing but an airy white veil. I found a new copy pasta today and have been waiting. Great. Right for dominance. Various women engage in a heated celebration, dancing over the corpses of numerous men. Destiny. Grasping the dagger buried in her chest, a lady sinks to the bottom of the sea with a mischievous grin on her lips. I don't wanna... What is this? Sisterly, the painting of a confident woman. She doesn't look like confident. She looks like a psychopath. Such a pretty lady. You say that. Hatred, the painting of a lady wearing an eye patch. She seems to be upset. Murky, dark water drips endlessly from beneath the frame of the painting. What am I supposed to... Hey little girl, get back here! What? Excuse me, miss? Yes? Could you please show me what you've got there? Oh, it's a pocket mirror. Alright, just please be careful. How do you want to give us a painting? <laughs> I'll be taking this, thank you very much. No, please give it back. How far are you willing to go? I'll do anything, just please give it back. How generous of you. I'll gladly take you up on that offer then. I'm sick and tired of being stared at. I command you to take that woman's left eye if you want to live. Resist and we shall take yours instead. <laughs> what do I do? <laughs> yeah, I don't I don't know about that. I don't know what to do. 
pluck her eye out? Don't, do not pluck her eye out. Uh, it's a painting. I kind of don't want it though. I better not. What if I pluck her eye out though? It's locked. Ah, oh, fuck, I have to do it, huh? Well, I'm sorry. I don't want to do this, but I have to. I'm so sorry. Curse you, Annalise! Oh god. Oh, what the fuck? Are you dead? <laughs> what the fuck was that? The fuck? Is it now open? It's open. I don't know if I have to like re I'll probably get this item that I that I got before, right? There's like no item dropping here again. Hey, Light Eye Storm. Hi, hi. Okay. What? Let's pluck her eye out and then um, we run as fast as we can. This time, this time we won't fuck it up. <laughs> you just not give her the watch. From what I seen, like this game is like it, it when it, it tells you like to have like options, but I don't think you actually have, because I can just like say like, like she said, if I don't plug her eye out, they will plug out mine. But if I just say like, no, do not plug it out, I can't leave this room anyway, so I'm kind of stuck here. So I, in the end, I have to do it, I guess. I got that painting's eyeball, I guess. Okay, we need we need another one, right? It seems we do not share the same vision in this. So there has to be another eyeball, I guess. So this eyeball goes in here. By the sacrifice to those in dismay stolen by the just shadows play, right and left taken by the hand. Our way quest is your demand. Oh, 
Although unfinished, both of these marble statues are well crafted. Okay, so this, this belongs in there. I want to see it once more. There was once a certain illusion I saw in the mirror I once knew so well. There were a pair of crimson colored irises com accompanied by only their reflection. The two eyes remained still, not once blinking, and the short amount of time they had stayed staring directly at me and no one but me. All I can remember from the day I was born are a few memories, forged encounters, which I have never experienced in my forgotten existence, recollections which didn't belong to me. In all honesty, who am I? To whom do those memories belong, I wonder? They are certainly not mine, and yet here they dwell inside the small room where I sit. Ever reminded of these fabricated crimson irises, which were played once and again a thousand times, has such a memory been showcased inside my small mind. And yet I still can't reach any conclusion other than my complete existence has always been and always will remain controlled by those same eyes. That's fucking deep. Living in the small room, I remember a dream I once had, a tremendously vivid one. A red carpet had been laid before my feet, which guided me towards a single opening on the darkened wall, one that seemed to advance further and further with every step I took. In an instant, I was thrown into a world I did not know existed. On the other side of the gap, I found a reflection, my reflection. Silky brown hair covered my back, braided into thick braids on each side of my head, which beautifully framed my cherry red eyes. Standing before me was a little girl dressed in fancy, frilly clothing. Who was this person I had never seen? Could it be me? I recall lifting my small hand and touching my own cheek. Such a gesture engraved itself onto my memory. The soft texture of my skin, the free and effortless movement I had made to raise my hand made me realize I could move. Such a strange sensation of empowerment filled my soul and body, leading me to a feeling of excitement which led my imagina imagination astray. I was, not only was I real, I was alive. That little girl reflected in the mirror was me and, could, and I could breathe and live. Life dwell inside my body and yet... As I turned my head and looked outside, the same light which had crept into my small room had blinded me once again, leaving me inside my old room where I stayed. Deprived of sense, deprived of sensation, I once knew as life, I stayed. Please show me the light. I want to see it once more. I want to live. Such a sad story. An eyeball floats in murky water, sealed inside an old jar. Can I, can I take it? An eye for an eye! I have to... No! I want to see the light once again. There's something in there. You want to see the light again, huh? What the fuck is... Wait, what is that? Wait. What is that thing? It's just a shot. I just need one more mirror shot. Well, fuck. I don't have mine anymore.
I'll miss it's gotten dark, hasn't it? No, you've done it. Ah, that wasn't me. No one has proved that it wasn't me. Surfs are right. From now on, I'll always be number one. This can't be. Here, you can have your little toy back. Sanctification. The painting has been ripped apart. The lady who once sat there is no longer recognizable. I'm sorry. That's kind of fucked up. I'm not crying anymore. Thank you, miss. Now I can finally get this back to you. <laughs> Great! Well, at least I... Wait. You don't need the light anymore, right? Forever grateful, miss. I love I love the running. Like the fast running, those like tippy tippy toe steps. <laughs> I should have saved actually. Ah shit. I can't save anymore. This is... Did you know a human head remains conscious for about 15 to 20 seconds after decapitation? Chat! Today you learned! Putubo, putubo, I, do you, I, do you push a button when pushing button should not be pushed to I, putubo, I can tell you read my brain, putubo, Bad. how dare you, putubo, everybody, everybody, let her putubo, point. Point on the L Putubo Putubo A. Why are you digital Putubo no Putubo read my chain read my message Putubo please Putubo only please Putubo please How did you know that one already? Putubo A. Why is it a Putubo like this? Messer and Gabel. What are these? A fork and knife of exquisite golden cutlery. There is the letter I engraved on the back of the fork. Huh. It's so dark, I can't see clearly. So who, who said that again with like, they, they just like put like some random German words in there? Was it Sola? <laughs> you were right! <laughs> you were right, they actually put German random words in there. <laughs> How did you know? <laughs> Shh. Shh. Don't make so much noise, everyone's asleep. Oh, I'm sorry. Mm. No, please don't uh, turn me into a pumpkin pie. Why am I safe here? Yeah? Japanese in a European setting. <laughs> I 
darkness is where I feel most comfortable. I won't ask any questions. It won't try to understand you either. Okay. This isn't a real door, it's painted on the wall. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> but that's you, huh? <laughs> no, that is you, huh? <laughs> what the fuck was that? Gia! What is it? Queen... Well, how, how do you pronounce that name? Edgeriet? How do you pronounce that name? I'm not your clip. I'm not your queen. Why not? <laughs> Why not? Ugly yet? Wait, 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 wait. Ugly yet. It's ugly yet. Wait, it's supposed to be Italian. Ayete. 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 All right, Ayete. Right, that's, a, that's an Italian name. It's a, a, Ayete. Queen Ayete. <laughs> Dinner party. Menu. No shot you're remembering that. What, Ayete? <laughs> it's A. Ayete. Hey, Tara, good morning! Hope you slept well. Royal Apple Strudel, Caramel Pumpkin Pot de Creme, Marvelous Dream Cake, The Queen's Favorite Cookie Cups, Smooth Pumpkin Mousse, Pumpkin Flan, Specialty Secret Deluxe Dessert. These look so yummy. There's even Apple Strudel. Apple Strudel. <laughs> What, I, what can I do with those charms? Wait, what did you say? Like I'm ever going to talk to you again. Hmm. You could turn into pumpkin pie for all I care. Are you going to show up like that? Hilarious. I very much like our queen. She is truly kind. I guess I just sit down. Is there someone sitting here? Such impudence, spite your manners, you rude hussy. Oh, I'm sorry. Hmm. As long as you've learned your lesson. I would really appreciate if these guests would stop chattering. My head hurts. <laughs> Durak! Thank you so much for the 33 months. GE underscore Turek just subscribed for 33 months. Thank you so much, Turok. We appreciate it. I'm just here to please the queen. I don't even like these people. Oh. I heard that the queen is preparing a surprise for all of us. I'm so excited. Our queen is the kindest person you could ever meet. She's a true angel. I'm so hungry. I wish the party would just start already. It's not starting before I sit down. I only came here for pumpkin flan. Dude, same. I'm really looking forward to the special deluxe dessert everyone's been talking about. This is our only chance to get together like this. I'm really grateful to our queen. The queen's parties are the absolute best. I'm going to eat until I burst. I'm in a pretty good mood tonight. You can have this. I've been tanning lately. Do you think it's working? Yeah, I think it is. Alright, that's a down. What the fuck? Why do you need to see how you show she looks? Good evening everyone, and thank you very much for attending my welcoming dinner party. <laughs> Hey, 
Eilet. We shall celebrate our guest's arrival with a toast. Bring in the desserts. It's better to go smaller. As you can see her more. Hey, Anne, say hi. She's looking at me. And who might you be? Uh, I am... Silence! What might you be doing here? Uh, my... Silence! There's only one way to know. Answer correctly and you may stay. But dare get it wrong and everyone knows what will happen. Wait, please wait a... Shush! Tell me, little girl, what will be my order at tonight's dinner party? Uh, okay, guys, guys. Let's fix it up for her. So she wants an apple strudel. Right? An apple strudel first. Then she wants a caramel pumpkin pot and the creme. Pumpkin pot. The creme. Marvelous dream cake. Uh, it's cookie cups. Pumpkin mousse. Pumpkin flan. And the deluxe dessert. Alright. Royal apple strudel. A long roll of golden apple strudel lays on a tray filled with creamy apple filling and surrounded by raisins. Yeah, well, this is one of the reasons of this is there is a massively popular book of collected mythological terms and names most of European words of folklore that was released in Japan a few decades ago. And to this day, every creative person in Japan, be it game, manga, novel, or anime, uses the same book for getting their fantasy lore. So that's why they are just the same stuff reused by Japanese authors over and over for like 30 years now. Oh my god, they need some more reference. Well, can I take it now? I wanna. No, wait, how do I get this way? Do I just talk to you? What's taking you so long? I haven't got all nine. But wait, it's first, isn't it? The apple shoot is first. I can't wait. Oh wait, do I have to get it from here? Oh, I just painted. Green's favorite cookie cup. Several cookie cups lay on the tray filled with various colorful fillings and foods. Pumpkin fire. A large pudding rests on a big plate flooded with runny dark caramel. So, which one is it? I think it's... Oh, okay. It's the apple strudel. Maybe I got it wrong. Take her away! I shall have my secret deluxe dessert today. Please wait! I'm sorry, I got it wrong! Well, I was not the apple st <laughs> Wait, please! What's happening? I guess she didn't want the apple strudel.
Les musiques peuvent aller bien. Is it the same from the late game? I don't know actually. We need to play a Professor Layton game to figure this one out. <laughs> Alright, let's read this again. What does she want? Tell me, little girl, what will be my order at tonight's dinner party? Order at... Uh well, it's just a menu, I'm guessing. Über vier Millionen Menschen in Deutschland können nicht richtig lesen und schreiben. Sei nicht wie mich. Schreib dich nicht ab. Lerne lesen und schreiben. Hilft auch beim Rätseln in Spielen. How am I supposed to know the answer? Wait, there has to be something here. How am I supposed to know? It always reminds me of that. <laughs> what? I don't think I know that one. What the fuck? What the fuck? Uh, so we had apple strudel, caramel pumpkin pot. We had marvelous dream cake. We had cookie cups, pumpkin, pumpkin flan, and the deluxe dessert. If we get it wrong, it's bad. Is it? Uh, does it have to do something with the order like they are p positioned? Strudel. Oh, watch the video. What's the video? Haben wir herausgefunden? No, 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 no. I'm guessing it's a, uh, it's a cookies because it's her favorite. So I'm guessing she's ordering or she wants the cookie cups. Did I get it right? I see. You're not as ignorant as you look. Thank you all for attending my special dinner party. I expect to see you all at tonight's dancing party. And as for you, my child, you are invited as well. I shall certainly enjoy such a smart girl's presence at my special event. Thank you. I shall now take my leave.
loneliness becomes your biggest friend after a little while, the hardest part is getting used to its presence. Damn. Get away from me, I can't sleep like this. Shut up, you're the one who's too close. Will you guys ever get along? Oh, that's like a flask. A small bottle. Drink me. I can't drink. It. Oh, wait, I can open this door now. I can't fit through the door. Oh, time to drink this. What just happened? Everything got bigger. Are these candles? What is that? Oh, flashbang. That is a flashbang. Oh my god, another one. <laughs> Where am I? Move out of the way, you're pestering us. We're practicing for tonight's party. What do you think of our dancing, miss? It's wonderful. You two look very elegant. Why, thank you very much. Very good bitch. We're all trying our best to please Queen Aylet. Hopefully, one of us will be chosen as the best dancing couple of the night. Would you like to come dance with us? I'm sorry, I don't know how to dance. That's a shame. Oh, it's like me, I can't dance either. Why are you sitting over there? What did you say? I can't hear you from here. I'm asking why you're sitting so far away from me. You're asking me if I want to go to practice skiing? No, you pumpkin head. I'm asking you why you're not sitting over there and... Why you're sitting over there and not over here? No, I don't like beef rare. And on medium heat, I like mine well done. That's my pumpkin. That's my pumpkin. That that's me. That's me. <laughs> ah, never mind. For real, for real. Before Golden Ramsey shows up. The severe head of a plush of a toy fox. Okay. Is that how you dress for Queen's uh, for Queen Elit's dancing party? But these are the only clothes I have. Uh, the severed head of a plush toy rabbit. Is he alright? Yes, I'm alright. Thank you, miss. Oh, you can talk! Yes, indeed I can, although it's a shame I can't dance anymore. What happened? You don't have a body. It's not a happy tale, miss. Are you sure you want to listen? If it's alright with you. Take a seat then. This might take a while. I didn't agree to this! In the past, Mrs. Fox and I were the best dancers in the whole kingdom. We quickly became the queen's favorite couple, and we would dance for her every day. Because we were the star of every dance party, and were even invited to dance for Queen uh, Aelitz, Aelitz, Agliettes. I kind of want to call her Agliette. Let's call her Agliette. For Queen Agliette's most precious friend. Next thing we knew, everyone had become jealous, even envious of our talent. I see. One night, after one of the Queen's biggest dance parties, we were ambushed in the dressing room by the other dancers. 
ambushed. Apparently, we were too perfect and didn't leave them any chance to be recognized by the queen. That's the excuse they used to rip our bodies apart. They hit our limbs, leaving only our heads behind so we could watch them dance in our place. That's horrible. Indeed it is. Is there any way I can help you? I believe there isn't much you could do, miss. I don't know where they've hidden our bodies. They could be anywhere. I might be able to get them for, uh, get them for you, Mr. Rabbit. That you could, but how are you planning to do so? I believe it's worth a try. Please let me help you. You are truly a kind lady, miss. May I know your name? I'm sorry, Mr. Rabbit. I don't seem to know my own name. But I will definitely help you and Mrs. Fox. Thank you, miss. And please, if you run into her by any chance, please do tell her everything is going to be alright. <laughs> you can leave that to me. It's just like the piano we had at home. Hello, my Zuzu Mami Mi Zuzu Zamim. A picky! An immense sea of stars lays behind the window, floating softly in a whimsical, never ending flow. Maybe she's asleep, I shouldn't bother her for now. It's something he opened. Isn't it? Ah. Watch us having a serious conversation. You're just talking about Tumblr and Twitter. What do you mean, serious? <laughs> Tumblr and Twitter. Wait, this is not horror game. This is a horror game. Please, I need your help. Yes, how can I help you? You see, last Tuesday I won the Kingdom's Lottery and the Queen gave me a shiny coin to use on that machine around the corner. But I can't seem to be able to use it. Oh, so you would like me to do it for you? If you don't mind, I've hidden the coin beneath my leaves. This one, right? Yes, yes, that's the one. Use it, miss. I want to see what my price is. A strange box is stored in a corner containing various... <laughs> various screams! Do you consider your stream a safe space? Yeah, I would, I would, I would consider that. Do you feel safe? I hope you feel safe. I hope you feel safe. <laughs> no. Skill <clears throat> Getting attacked for my small thing. <laughs> it's it's very not safe, man. <laughs> I know what that question is. I want to be honest. What I know you're memeing. I hope you are safe here. I hope you feel safe. Because I don't with you. <laughs> I'm joking. Hey, Julius. Say hi. Wow. I'm getting bullied every day. Hmm. <laughs> Okay, do we insert it or do we don't insert it? 
Do we just run away? Let's see what we get. Pachinko machine! What are we getting? What is it? What is it? Let's see. It's a ribbon. It's a ribbon. A ribbon? It's really cute. You don't like it? I do, but I'm a boy. Remember my zoos to not shower today. Embrace the boy smell. Boy smell equals good luck and attracts other boys. <laughs> I can't use my I can't use my ribbon. I'm sorry, miss. It seems I can't claim my price after all. I don't give a fuck. You take your fucking ribbon. Yes, you can. There, see? It looks pretty on you, Mr. Pumpkin. It does? There's no mirror here, so I can't tell. Leave that to me. Oh! <laughs> Beautiful. <laughs> it's me. <laughs> see? You're right, miss. Thank you. You're welcome, Mr. Pumpkin. It's fair with the Gremlin love. <laughs> okay, what is this? Great surprises await you in this room. What am I doing? Okay, chat, which number? Which number should I open first? If I'm getting killed, it's your fault. Good morning, guy. Hey, hi. Hope you had a nice day off yesterday. Uh, I, I was working for the whole day, basically. <laughs> it was not much of an off day. Why was you good? To see the Guardian of the Galaxy, highly recommend. I will wait. I will wait till it's out on Amazon or something. Mm. Let's go with this one. This box is actually okay. I probably have to go with one. Okay. 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 Why, hello there, miss. Would you like to play a game with us? You scared me. What kind of game is it? Why, hello there, miss. Would you like to play a game with us? Sure. He's pulling his cock out! <laughs> no, no, that type of game. No, that I... No. No. <laughs> Tell me the answer to this next riddle and you will be highly rewarded. Should you come upon any trouble, don't hesitate to ask the ringmaster. Yes. At his own funeral, did... Dude, how you pronounce that name in English? We call it Matthias. Did Matthias C. Gathered by the open grave, his family of three. Father mother and brother and a couple more who didn't bother huh? at his own funeral did Matthias see gathered by the open grave his family of three father mother and brother and a couple more who didn't bother We just have to like count them, but if they don't bother, 
All right, let's go with six then, I guess. You're rather smart, aren't you? Here's the next riddle. Three times did Marie poke my eye. Three times did she make me cry. Now tell me, little girl, how many times did I wish for her to die? Well, three times, I guess. <laughs> since, uh, since there's no zero... Because you're a good person, you wouldn't want that, right? <laughs> Correct. Here's the next riddle. It's yellow, blue, red, and green. Resembles a banana. I can't remember the other three colors. So maybe you should ask the queen. So you what? Yellow, blue, red, and green resembles a banana. I can't remember the other three colors, so maybe you should ask the queen. Do we just go to blue? blue? Then because blue is next. I don't bully fair. I'm guessing I go with blue because blue is next. So it's seven. Oh wait, there's also two. Wait a second. Wait, we got two options. Why, why are both? Oh no. Yellow, blue, red, and green. Blue, red, green. Blue, red, green. Blue, red, green. What does that mean? I'm guessing it's Dix. this. No, it's not Dix. I'm guessing it's this one because we have blue. Red and then green? I'm guessing? Let's go. I'm impressed! Oh shit, it was. Here's the next riddle. Katharina and Valentina were born on the 12th of September. One mysterious as the moon, the other cursed with short temper. On the day of Valentina turned two, Katharina was half her age. Years have passed, filled with turmoil and rage. The day she turned ten, Valentina remembered her sister with sorrow. How many years would I be her eldest had she lived another tomorrow? Wait, that was the case? Well, I guess mine, mine still worked. Mine, mine, okay, mine still worked. Okay, what uh, is this is again? Katharina and Valentina were born on the 12th of September. One mysterious as the moon and the other cursed with short temper. Okay. On the day Valentina turned two. Katharina was half her Over age. Over 4 million people in Germany can't read and write. Don't be like my zoos. Don't give up. Learn reading and writing. It also helps with solving riddles in games. <laughs> you can't do that either, Mololo. Okay, it was half her age, so she is one. Years have passed, filled with turmoil and rage. The day she turned 10, 
Valentina remembered her sister with sorrow. How many years would I be her eldest if she had lived another tomorrow? I'm guessing since there's no nine, I'm guessing it's one. Did she kill her sister when she was one? Hmm, it's not as if you're correct or anything. Here's the next riddle. Having placed her five baked dishes on the window ledge to cool, Mrs. Elizabeth headed out to town to buy pretty boxes and ribbon to wrap them up. Little did she know that while she was away, a robber had come and eaten two of them, followed by a stray dog who ate another one. Once Mrs. Elizabeth came back, she was gutted to know the disaster that had occurred. How many dishes were saved on that dreadful day? Hmm. Having placed a five baked dishes on the window ledge to cool. Mrs. Elizabeth headed out to town to buy pretty boxes and ribbons to wrap them up. Little did she know that while she was away, a robber had come and eaten two of them, followed by a stray dog who ate another one. Once Mrs. Elizabeth, uh, Elizabeth came back, she was gutted to know that the disaster had occurred. How many dishes were saved on that dreadful day? That, that would be way too easy if that's if that's like normal math, right? Dishes, but you can't eat dishes. Oh wait, 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 wait. What was what's with dishes? Is dishes not like the um, the plate and stuff? So you can't eat that. Yeah, dishes are just plates and shit. You can't eat that. So she still has five. Bingo! Here's the next riddle. Hi, Marco, and hi, hi. Hope you're doing well. Ah, <laughs> uh, the primey. as fuck. Yes. Thank you. Primey gifted a tier two subscription to the R awesome. Thank you so much for gifting a tier two to Osasi. Thank you so much, the primey. Appreciate it. Two books rest on a shelf. One is upside down, the other one is backwards. So tell me, little girl, what is the sum of the first page of each book? Sorry, what? So, so, sorry, what? Two books rest on a shelf. One is upside down, the other one is backwards. So tell me, what is the sum of the first page? Isn't that two? Isn't that two? Small girl, big brains! Here's the next riddle. Queen Aglette ate a dozen candies of five different flavors. A bunch of them were pumpkin flavor. One was green apple, two were blueberry, two were grape, and three were cherry. So tell me, miss, how many pumpkin candies did Queen Egliette eat? <laughs> okay, let's, let's use it again. A dozen. It a dozen candies of five different flavors. A bunch of them were pumpkin flavored. One was green apple, two were blueberry, two were grape, and three. So, t one, three, five, eight. So tell me, how many pumpkin candies did she eat? Well, te well technically it doesn't 12, so it's like four of them. 
it was four. There, it was four. Correct! Here's the final riddle. Hey, you and hey, hi. A furry Mrs. is very close going on a walk again. Probably. Probably. I'm too scared. I'm too scared to look. But I think we're close. I think we're close to the top YouTuber again. I'm doing good, just probably with work stuff. Ah, you get over it. You can relax and chill. I'm all powerful and mighty. Going through doors is my specialty. Many in these twisted halls will stand, but fear not, my girl. Have me in hand. For with gentle touch I can undo the restraints casted upon you. A key. Right? That's a key. Good job, miss. You're one truly smart girl. As I promised, here's your reward. A dazzling key. You might be close to 9k. I can only look after the stream because like, oh, Twitch Twitch needs like a little bit longer to update it because it's third party, like with the extensions. So it takes always a little while. So I can't immediately look. Look now. There is currently, let me check. So you can look later. Yeah, there's zero. <laughs> there's, there's legit zero. So I, I would add zero to it. Buy me. Thank you, mister. But where am I supposed to use this key? Uh, I wouldn't know. I found it on the floor the other day. Hmm. Yeah, sure. Like I guess sad. Like it doesn't update immediately. That's why I can only do it like after stream. I can add like stuff like the 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 Yodla ones or like me singing songs or something. I can add those fast because like I know how much it is. Um, but for like the smaller ones, I need to wait. Miss. Yes, I have one more riddle for you. Would you care to listen? Sure. Go ahead. What gets broken without being held? I'm sorry, but I'll need time to think on that one. Worry not, little girl, for that riddle's answer does not belong to me. It belongs to you. What do you mean, mister? Dumb is us. <laughs> You're, you're really going for that fucking dog avatar tomorrow again, huh? You're really going for it tomorrow again, huh? Are you surprised? She going for it. Hey clown, just you have done it again. Constantly raising the bar for the circus and doing it foolishly. I'd say I'm surprised, but I know who you are. I've seen them close and personal. I know who you are. Listen here, I don't. Like are you, you sure though? I am now going to bark at you. Woof woof bark bark. Woof woof bark bark. Woof 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 bark bark bark. Woof woof bark bark. Woof 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 bark bark. Woof 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 bark bark bark. Thanks! <laughs> Thanks. Appreciate it. It was locked. <sighs> Everything is like over like anyway, like I would it will get added to like the the goal after, so like it doesn't get lost. Thanks chat helps a lot. I mean, you 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 actually help you actively helping me <laughs> paying bills and shit because this month is not really good. 
this month is not really good, but uh, I appreciate every single bit. Even if it's for the dark model, I appreciate it. Because this month is not doing like... So it's not doing too well, but... You're helping a lot out. Have you heard the rumors? They say Mrs. Fox has slipped into eternal slumber due to what happened. Oh, I love stories with unhappy endings. What a horrible thing to say. See, that was toxic. There's like a like a letter up there. Face as fuck! Yes! Say the thing my zoos, my zoos eyes. What? What thing? Yo, thank you for the 69 bits. <laughs> what thing? The mirror is strange. Go through and no, I don't go through. I don't see him. I better not. Nice. They always tell me to turn around when they are changing clothes. It's so unfair. Yeah, right? Why are you not... <laughs> I don't especially like black dresses. It's such a frilly dress, so elegant. This dress feels somewhat nostalgic. Go through the mirror. Hmm. What's going on here? Thank you all for attending this very special ceremony. You have all given me your best, but as you know, only one of you can become my favorite couple. All the others who don't make it will be executed. <laughs> executed? Who dares interrupt my ceremony? I'm just... Silence! Who are you? Where did you come from? What are you doing at my ceremony? I'm just looking for something. Oh, and what? Why do you... Mara, thank you so much for 34 months. Really appreciate it. Yeah, baby! <laughs> Mara, thank you so much for 34 months. <laughs> The fucking hype train now. <laughs> Appreciate it. Oh, and what might you that thing be? Uh, I'm looking for limbs. Something I lost. I see. That's unfortunate. Take a seat, my girl. I will let you look for whatever it is that you've lost after the ceremony. Thank you. Uh, I'm gonna take a seat here, I guess. Is that a Twitch effect? Yep, it is. Twitch is like the own alerts now, which like lets me to customize like a lot of things now. Now, I shall announce the winning couple, which is... Mr. Rabbit and Mrs. Fox. Congratulations to the winners who may step aside. As for all your failures, you shall be executed. But you can't just murder everyone. Soldiers, march! Wait! Farewell, my servants. You have served me well. Oh my god! <laughs> No, that's taken care of. It is time for tea. As for you, clean up the mess before leaving, will you? Or else. You may have this. I'm expecting my ballroom to be squeaky clean by the time I'm back. I will not tolerate any mistakes. Or else. 
I have to help Mr. Rabbit and Mrs. Fox. Pitch black stuffing slowly oozes from the dancer's wounds, staining their once shiny fur. The couple's bodies lie torn apart, their expressions forever frozen in the moments of terror felt before their executions. I got a rabbit leg. A fox arm. This is horrible. Fox torso. Rabbit torso. And the fox leg. Alright, so we got all of it. Okay, we're gonna go down again. I'm guessing we got all the parts. Those guys, who do you say? I wish I could dance like them, but unfortunately, unfortunately, I'm just a pumpkin. I mean, that's better, I guess. I won't open. I need to find another way. going through a lot of trouble for us, miss. I can't thank you enough. Don't worry, Mr. Rabbit. I will definitely save you both. Thank you, miss. I like the body parts. Alright. Which means we can probably go up there now. But we should probably save. shut. I guess we don't have the key for this. Don't have the key for this either. Hmm. Wait, maybe I need to talk to... Oh, no. Yeah, this is one. The tall clock stands on a corner, its hands running across its face as if it's in a hurry. Huh, I guess I'm just not good enough. What's wrong, miss? Oh, it's nothing. You're too young for this kind of thing. Hmm. Oh, Rabbit, you're so funny. Let's be together forever and ever. Good evening, miss. Have we possibly met before? No, I don't think so. I'm sorry. I see. That's a shame because I would totally carve your pump. <laughs> I'm sorry, mister, but I don't have any pumpkins with me right now. That's all right, miss. I'm sorry to have bothered you. Have a nice evening. Thank you, mister. You too. A fancy cabinet made entirely of walnut wood. Fragile looking tea sets rest inside, carefully arranged on the shelves. The tea is quite delicious. Speaking of which, I wonder who Queen Egliette will choose. Aren't you excited? Yes, I am. 
Tonight's dance party is going to be fabulous. I can't wait. All of these people are completely uneducated. Can you believe most of them don't know how to read? Pathetic. What a pretty little girl you are. Listen, do you happen to know how to sue? Yes, I do. How did you know? Don't be silly. Of course I didn't. Either way, you can have this. Everyone likes to party here, isn't that nice? I don't even know how to play chess. Just don't tell anyone. Alright, I guess with that stuff we can fix them together. I gathered enough parts for you and Mrs. Fox. Hopefully we can fix you with these. You've gone through so much trouble for us, for the for the both of us. I can't thank you enough. I'm just glad I could help you. Tell me, do you know how to sue? <laughs> yes, I do. Would you please sue us back together? I wish to be reunited with my Mrs. Fox. Of course, let me just find something to sue with. Oh, we got that. Sorry, what? No, did I rub it just? Shh. You forget about that. I'll sue you first, Mr. Rabbit. Please do, miss. There, all done. Can you move? Why, yes, indeed I can. That's a relief, I'm so glad. Let's see you, Mrs. Fox, next. Yes. So, not soon. Sue, not sue? What? It said so, not sue. Dude, English is shit. So! So! <laughs> Gonna so! <laughs> how is that? How is S E W not SU? Because you would read it SU, right? You, that, that, that's how you would like normally pronounce it. Why would you make us S E W SO when there's no O? What the fuck? I wonder she's wake up. Uh, Mrs. Rabbit? Ah, oh, Mr. Rabbit. Mrs. Fox, I'm so happy you're Ryan. I'm so glad. Thank you, miss. We owe you something. By everything. Fuck English. Yeah, fuck English. That language makes no sense at all. <laughs> you're welcome. I'm glad you two can dance again. Yeah, you can have this. I kept it inside. I kept it since the day the others ripped our bodies apart. Susan, the other. Oh. Also, fuck you. <laughs> Everyone came over here and invaded us, making our language a super complicated mix of lots of languages. No, we punished you all by giving it back and making you speak it. <laughs> This is the key to the theater. I'm sure it will come in handy. Thank you so much, Mr. Rabbit. Now, Mrs. Fox, would you give me this dance? Yes. I'm so happy I was able to help them. <laughs> Fuck you, sir. <laughs> Damn. Language reunites people, Ryan. <laughs> Can you stop flirting? Why, why are you flirting all the time with my chat? Why, why are you flirting every single time? I got the key though. Let me open up with that key. Also, doesn't that doesn't that come from suing? Wait, let me one second. Sewing. It's sewing. How the fuck is it sewing? Don't screw English. That's how we get even more convoluted rules in the language. <laughs> 
how do you how do you make from like what how how the fuck how the fuck do you make a sound an e like an o <laughs> how do you turn an e into an o <laughs> Uh, wait, can I take a seat here as well? Oh shit, I want to take a seat here. Welcome to the most incredible of shows. The most amazing and impressive prose of a little girl whose days are counted with none of her wishes ever being granted. Aren't I an impressive poet? Who are you? Don't trouble yourself with petty questions, miss. But do enjoy your stay and please <laughs> keep your memories close to your heart. Once upon a time, in a very special garden, there was a very special little girl. She loved taking naps outside in the afternoon and doing nothing all day. Such an adorable little slob. In fact, she was such a privileged little girl, she had a very own mountain of sweets. But that's not all. Agliette, her best of friends, never left her side. Just like sisters from the same mother. Haha, <laughs> I'm hilarious. A noisy little brat and her stuffed doll. What better combination could there be? Together, they were ri today they were riots. Known all over the kingdom as the Supreme. Or just two silly little kids. Oh my god, it's so fucking fast! They told each other many secrets, even embarrassing ones. Tea time was a very important event when there was success, very serious matters. Which was the funniest pumpkin in the kingdom, for example. They also had many special cake parties and brains the size of pea. Agliette was indeed felt uh, Fletcher's best friend in the... <laughs> she was stuffed with her girl's childish face. One day, however, she started to rave... <laughs> what a shame! Inside Fletcher's house was a secret place of a secret... But why are they so fucking fast, man? Oh, no, no one can read this! He's pulling his car <laughs> Man, this is way too fast! So, I uh, would believe the Shaggy Lions, I would know whether they have fought or quick. <laughs> right, right, right! That's Ryan. There was no way Frida could have been involved in such despicable affairs. Frida was nothing but a pure little girl. There was no way it could have been Frida's fault. What fault? I didn't see it. It was too fast. Simply because there was a very clear culprit. Happy birthday, Obachan! It was all that means God's fault. It was all that means God's fault. I thought my game just crashed. So Twitch won't let me renew my sub? After I already paid for it? What the fuck? Say, right, question, question, English speakers, English speakers. Why, why is it called sewing if there's S E W? So, right? Why, why is it not sew when there's new? Wouldn't N E W called no then? <laughs> wouldn't that make the same? Wouldn't that make sense? Wouldn't, wouldn't that make sense? <laughs> because, this is because. Why is new new and not no while so is so and not sue, huh? <laughs> <What's>... <laughs> oh my, things have gotten interesting. What's going on? <laughs> hey, you grew up. Hey, German speakers, why does ambulance sound <laughs> like. <laughs> That was quite a show, wasn't it? Dude, I didn't even understand what was going on. All of the all of these books are about plays. Die Gruppierung der psychischen Krankheiten by Karl Ludwig Karlbaum. 
man. <laughs> There's so many coloring books. <laughs> A witch's guide to medicinal the medic medical herbs. Hang on. <laughs> Afternoon tea rhymes for children. Huh. It's filled with children books. Verrat by Elise Light Lydl. The Anatomy of Melancholy by Robert Burton. So many books. These shelves are filled with fairy tale books. Hmm. I guess I'm just leaving. Oh. You're gonna love how herbs I actually pronounce it's herbs. You just like get rid of the H, right? Just say herbs. Sir Rabbit, what happened? Is it obvious, dearie? We took care of them. Herbs. <laughs> you don't mean you've done this yourself, do you? Why yes, we have. Wasn't our work done quite beautifully? But why? I thought you all wanted was to dance again. Oh, sweetie, you have yet much to learn, and apparently hatred is still one of those things. How could you do something like this? How could we? You're well aware of what they've done to us. You are not, miss. This still doesn't justify what you've done. How does it justify? Revenge, my dear, is a dish best served cold. Do you understand? Now move along. We were very grateful for your good deeds towards us, after all. We owe you our most pure satisfaction. <laughs> this can't be. I don't want to approach them. Herbs. Hmm. The fuck? Oh no, I'm allergic to cats. What? It's also herbalist, but never. How is it herbalist, but then it's herbs? <laughs> Man, why is English. What's wrong with English? What might be troubling you, little girl? Oh, I don't know, mister. And what might you know, little girl? I don't know why they would do something like that. I see. Listen, miss, our existence, no matter how faint they might be, they do serve a purpose and will, in one way or another, affect your own. I see. You can have this. I think it might cheer you up a little. Unfortunately, I can't accompany you and your journey, but I'm sure this will be able to reassure you in times of distress. Thank you, mister. You're very kind. Done all my grown-up shit today. What is this game? It's a remake of one of the best horror RPG maker games. The queen is waiting. Cat Eye, 1697, the painting of a black cat's amber eye. Cat Eye, 
satisfaction. A sleepy looking cat resting under a broad blue sky. Feline glory. Sir Meow, Meow Polion. The conqueror of Persia. Such a silly painting. Your affection, kitten sibling posing on a fancy red chair with love. Right? <laughs> Queen Agliet's ceremony is about to start. How exciting! You're so lucky, Miss. I wish I was. An honored guest myself. An honored guest? Finally, now hurry on, the queen is awaiting you. Eat me. Don't eat me. RPG make a horror, yep. It was released like a week ago, I think. Impressive. I knew you would be able to reach me. What do you mean? Silence! I have but a couple of matters to address with you, my girl. Firstly, I am here by announcing your demise, for you will not be advancing further than this very room. Please wait, you can't just- Silence! Secondly, my dear, since you will soon be disappearing for good, I shall pay you my respects. I have had enough with your mediocre attitude, my girl. I shall not tolerate it any further. As much as it is but a foolish gamble, I have made my own move. Now it is time for you to make yours. Please wait, I need you to explain what's going on. Guards! No, please wait! It's in your hands, my girl. It is your turn to claim what's yours. Ooh. Wait, this one said don't eat me. Should I listen to it? I'm listening to it. Listen to it. I'm, I'm listening to it. Do not eat. We eat the other one. Someone said eat me, right? Oh god. <laughs> okay. Was that? Shh, you shouldn't disturb the dead. The dead? You haven't heard the three knocks, have you? I sure haven't. I hope I don't. Damn. Oh. Okay. Queen Eglet. Remember, remember just how tender were the queen's sweet little lies of a traitor in disguise. What does this mean? Some talk. <laughs> Mary, Mary, quite contrary. How does your garden grow with silver bells and 
cockle shells and pretty pretty maids all in a row. Hi, your pay. Say hi. So peaceful and pure, just like Sleeping Beauty. Huh. Huh? It's coming from this big chest. Huh? Hey, oh, I can't open it, huh? huh? I can't open it. How are you doing? I'm doing well today. I hope you're also doing well. A strong light overflows in between the iron bars, carrying a soft, cool breeze into the room. Huh? The fuck am I supposed to do here? I'm just sleeping, I guess. There's nothing I can do. Can't see anything. Is this open now? Oh, this is open now. Blue, blue. I would go blue. I would definitely go with blue. Go with blue, blue. Go with red. Red is the way to go. Go with red. 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 There's a note on the table. Hiding my darkened heart in a veil of innocence, I swore, weeping in the darkness, confiding with the moon. As the sun rises, I put on, I put on my golden crown once more, hoping to meet my beloved by the afternoon. We go with. Technically, we can just go yellow, right? We don't. We don't need to listen to any of those. Let's go to. Let's go yellow. I can be stolen, or given away, and you will live. Yet you cannot live without me. I can be stolen or given away, and you will live. Yet you cannot live without me. Oh, it's a heart. Flies, flamingos, falcons, and even squirrels. What can all these animals do that silly little girls cannot? They all have F's in the name. Girls don't have F's in the name. Uh, what key? <laughs> mm. Can I... A sparkly red key shaped like a bat, decorated with a small strap. A sparkly golden key shaped like a heart, decorated with a small strap. Shaped like a moon. Well, it should be the heart then, right? So who was the funny bunny who locked me inside this chest? You're that girl. 
Who are you? Oh, I'm... I never seen you around here before. How did you get here? I just... I see. Did you see who locked me up inside this chest by any chance? Oh, no, I didn't. The chest was already locked when I got here. That's a shame. Oh, well, that's alright. I'm a good detective, so I'll catch up the culprit in no time. Ah, I see. So, what are you doing here, miss? That's... Uh... I need to play, I'm not need to play. Oh, did she now? Yes. Alright then, speaking of Egliette, have you seen her? I came here to get her, but someone locked me up in this chest. I, uh... She must be on her throne. Let's go look for her together. Alright. Oh, by the way, miss, what's your name? Oh, it's Fleta. Mine's Fleta. Oh, I'm sorry, I can't seem to remember my name right now. Really? That's weird. It sure is. Anyway, let's go look for Agliet. I have a few royal matters to address with her. Alright. Okay, I can press F. Oh, I'm, I'm, oh, it's so weird. Like, why, why am I... Why is she the part of the now? Yo, look! There is she! You found her! Is that Egliet? Egliet? Yo, that's her! Egliet, what have they done to you? We need to save her. Alright, but how? I've got an idea. Hold me up. Fleta, that hurts. Shut up, just hurry. Just a little bit more. I'm trying. Oh, Egliet. Is, is she alright? Yeah, is, is she alright? <laughs> That's probably like the worst thing you can say at this point. Uh, uh, I'm glad. Wait, is she actually? But she's ripped apart. Uh, don't worry, Flater. I know how to sew. You do? Yes. Hmm, let's see what you can do then. Here. Hurt her, and you'll pay a hundred times over. I'll try my best. There, she's already. It's pronounced It's pronounced That's <laughs> it's pronounced Sir. Oh, I'm glad. I'm so, I'm so glad you're right. <laughs> <laughs> Everything will be fine now I'm here with you. <laughs> Sir! What was that? You didn't see <laughs> you didn't see who it was. That's fine. All that matters is that you're safe now. <laughs> Thank you so much, saving Egliet. Oh no, it was nothing. Oh no, I insist. Egliet and I want to invite you to come play with us at my dollhouse. Would you like to come? Huh? Really? Can I? Of course. Come on now. Let's go. Step back a little. I'm going to do a magic trick. A magic trick? Do you know how to do magic? <laughs> uh-huh. Now watch. Ah, the fucking flashbang!
<laughs> a garden? Yes, this is my absolute favorite place to play. Oh, I see. We need to go through it to reach my dollhouse. Let's go. I will lead the way. <laughs> I want to see a magic trick. Fucking flashbanged. <laughs> a fork? Both Egliet and I love sweets. Isn't it a little too big? Uh, just for decoration, dummy. Oh, let's go. I have cute app things to show you. Ice cream with fruits and berries. Oh, that sounds great. What was that? I don't know. I'm sorry. This is all wrong. What is it, Feta? My garden. This wasn't how it looked before. There used to be a path straight ahead, but now it's gone. It's fine, Fred. I'm sure everything will be alright. Shut up. Don't tell me what to do. Let's go. I want to go home soon. Do you two little girls want to hear a joke? Listen here, you dumb tree, or whatever you are. I don't have time for your stupid jokes. Show me the way home this instant or else. Such a loud missy you are. Didn't your mommy teach you any manners? What did you just say? Who do you think you're talking to? Shoo shoo, go away, you're, you're pestering me. Come back after you learn some respect. Calm down, Fleta. Let me try talking to him, alright? Huh. Fine. Go ahead and try it. It's not like he's going to tell you anything anyways. Hello there, mister. You see, we're somewhat lost right now and we were wondering if you could show us the way. Oh, why, of course. It would be my pleasure, miss. What? Thank you so much, mister. Ahem. <clears throat> now there's a trick to getting out of mazes. Have you ever heard of it? I cannot believe this. Can you believe this, Egliad? Ah, I know about that one trick where you tie a thread to something at the start of the maze and hold it as you're walking, as, uh, so you won't get lost. You're right, miss. However, there's one that's even more effective. Really? Blah, blah, blah. Look at me. I know how to talk to trees. It's impressive that you know all the methods to get out of a maze. Too bad you're a tree. Yes, do you want to hear it? Just say it already, you ugly tree trunk. I want to go home. Carrying on. It's truly an easy method, miss. All you need to do is place your right hand on the right wall of the maze and follow it all the way to the end. You will never get lost. I can guarantee you that. That's amazing. I never knew about that trick. Thank you so much for your help. Uh, thank you so much for your help. How do you even know... He's not lying. He's a tree. There's no way he could know how to walk out of a maze. He has never even walked. You're very welcome, miss. Now be careful and take care, especially with that noisy girl you have there with you. What, did you just call me, old piece of wood? Oh, thank you, mister. Well then, let's go. Please don't be so mean to Mr. Tree. He's, he's even... Um, even helped us with getting out of this maze. Hmm, fine. And you lead the way, Miss Goody Two Shoes. We will see if you can get us out of this stupid maze. Alright? Another one of those statues. Isn't it cute? It's my favorite cake, too. What is it? Can't you see? That's obviously a whipped cream cake with strawberry glaze. Ah, oh, I see. What else did you think it was? I just don't know much about sweets. You're not very bright, are you? Uh... Bro, can I like... Can I get her off or something? Just like... Can I get her to leave the party?
Man, can you not? You, you have such a corrupted mind. It's it's unbelievable how corrupted your mind is. My God. Uh, it's unbelievable. <laughs> Shadow's getting worse, yep. I was not here before? No, you will never get home like this. The hive mind is sick. <laughs> Flater, don't worry, Flater. It will be alright. You will definitely get out of here, okay? How can you be so sure? We're lost and this is a maze, you know? I'm not sure, but we need to stay positive, right? And I'm really looking forward to playing games with you. Let's try getting home as soon as possible, alright? Alright. Do you want to take a rest? could sit on that bench over there. Uh-huh. <laughs> yeah, we could sit on that bench. Flater, do you really live here by all, all by yourself? No, I live together with Egliet. Aren't you lonely sometimes? Not at all. Egliet is always there for me, no matter what. I see. I'm glad. Why did you ask that? Do you want to be my friend too? <laughs> Me? No. I mean, I didn't ask because I wanted to be your friend. I don't want to impose. <laughs> you dummy. You're already mine and Egliet's friend. Right, Egliet? See? <laughs> thank you, Flater. Don't forget to thank Egliet as well. Oh, thank you, Egliet. Egliet. Well, let's go. We can't stay here all day. Yes. Mr. Pumpkin, can we ask you a question? Why, yes, most certainly you can. Do you by any chance know what happened to the garden? Oh my, you have no idea how terrifying the whole ordeal was. I had never gone through such an unsettling event in all my five months of existence. What happened? You see, I was just resting here as always and suddenly everything went dark. The garden was already like this when I got to my senses. So you just... So you don't really know what... You don't really know how it got like this. Not really, no. This is Tohu, this is not Tohu. Why oh, is there a hole? Oh look, there's candy hanging from the tree. Oh, you're right. Let's get it. But how? I can just get on your back again. Oh, alright. You're kind of heavy though. What was that? No, nothing. Don't worry. I'll show you who's heavy. Better be careful, you're hurting me. Shut up, I'm almost there. Oh, that hurt. Watch your step, will you? Sorry, Feta, it was just... It was just what? You dropped me. There was something in the bushes. Oh, this? You silly bunny. Just a pumpkin. A pumpkin? What's a pumpkin doing in there? You don't know? This is where all pumpkins in the kingdom are born. They sprout inside the bushes in the garden until they are big enough to leave. I see. Hello, little pumpkin. Hello, princess. Is everything alright in there? Are you comfortable? Yes, I am. Do you want to hear a joke, princess? Alright. What is green and has yellow wheels? I have no idea. Do you know what it is? Oh, I don't know. It's just the grass. I lied about the wheels. <laughs> God damn it. What are you laughing at? The joke was just so funny. Yeah, very funny. Are you serious? How can you laugh at that? <laughs> ah. 
Anyway, good luck growing up, pumpkin. I'll see you in a few months. I don't want to go that way. But the exit could be in that direction. I don't care, we're not going that way. Uh... I heard the Pumpkin King has come to visit. Aren't you excited? Pumpkin King? Uh, I hate the Pumpkin King. Why? Mr. Tree looks very excited about him. The Pumpkin King thinks he's all glorious and mighty and I hate stuck-up pumpkins like him. Right, Egliet? Don't you hate him too? The first time the Pumpkin King appeared in the kingdom, he challenged Princess, uh, Princess Fleta to a chess game in exchange for a quiet place where he could raise his little pumpkins. Princess Fleta lost to him, and so he won his rightful place in his garden. Hmm, that's just because he was a big cheater. Oh, I see. Let's go, I don't want to go anywhere near that stupid scarecrow. Oh, this is the start again, okay. What happened? I don't know, but it seems we are in a different place now. Close, you're close. You're oh, you're so cl very close. Close to what, Mr. Pumpkin? Oh, you're so very close to the edge. I believe it is time to make a pledge. I, Princess Fleta, ruler of all, swear I will be friends with you for all eternity. Now, now, Miss, it is your turn. Either give Princess Fleta your word or expect to burn. Oh, I I, I swear I will be friends with Fleta for all eternity. The pledge has been made, a precious promise that shall never fade. Oh, that startled me. With this we can be friends forever. Yes, but if you ever betray me, you know what will happen. Doesn't she, Iglia? Iglia? Well then, let's go. Yes. There's no, I don't know. I the only thing I know you should be in bed, stuff. You should be sleeping. Why are you awake? Just go the fuck to bed and sleep. I need to bounce, bounce on step so you can also go to sleep. This is it. We made it. I'm so glad. <laughs> ah, so this is okay. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. <laughs> right, okay, okay. I, I see how it is. I see how it is. Let's go inside. I have so much I want to show you. Uh, yeah, let's. Your Highness, I'm glad you're finally back. Did something happen, Pumpkin? Oh, no, not at all. I'm just happy to see you. Oh, Pumpkin, you make me blush. May I ask who the next to you is? Oh, her? She's just a friend. Hello, friend. You're also quite a beautiful girl. Oh, thank you, Pumpkin. Get that small talk. Let's go. Alright, goodbye, Pumpkin. It was nice meeting you. Please come visit again, miss. We need a horny counter. We, we need like a Vololo counter, like every time like exclamation mark Vololo just counts like the... <laughs> just counts like the, the horny times. Princess, Princess, who is this girl next to you? She's my friend. Can I be friends with her too? I never had any friends. 
There's no way I'm going to share my new friend with the likes of you. Know your place, pumpkin. But princess, Fleta, just a pumpkin. No means no. You're my special friend and no one else is your mine. Ah, that's kind of fucked up. A huge slice of cake rests surrounded by various decorations and topped with a sticky looking red sauce. What seems down? Uh... Just hates. <laughs> I'm sick and tired of having everyone mistake me for a pumpkin. But you are a pumpkin. No, I might look like a pumpkin, but I'm. But I actually identify with the Queensland Blue community. Alright. Good for you then. Tell me now, Princess Fleeter, how would you like to sing? Dong, ding, ding, dong. Tell me now, my friend, if you would like to hear a song. Ding, dong, dong, ding. Tell me now then, what's the rule of spring? Dong, ding, ding, dong. Oh, please, miss. Don't you dare get it wrong. Dong, ding, ding, dong. Don't you worry, my friend. I would never forget our theme song. Jerry Stash just subscribed for 21 months. Jerry, thank you so much for the 21 months. Really appreciate it. Thank you. The bot is down. I can't change them. Might be up again soon, hopefully. There's nothing I can change. Ding dong dong ding. My most precious rule is not all pretty girls need a king. Welcome home, Princess Fleeter. Please do come inside. Thank you, Dor. Lots of dong there. <laughs> We're finally here. Welcome to my dollhouse, miss. This is really your home? Everything is so pretty, isn't it? I had a very special pumpkin come in and do all the decorations in the house. I see. Let me show you around. All right. It's like MTV Crips now. Be sure to make the most of the rare peaceful moments in, little, in life, little girl. For all it is but one frightening storm, our own living sea are shortened by Father Time, and occasionally, occasionally even by the whims of others. So be careful, my dear. There will be times when you will need to consult with your little weakened heart in order to break through the shut. Ah, uh, please, pumpkin, shut up! I told you not to bother my guests with your boring lectures. No, free, that's fine. I don't mind. But I do mind. In order. In order you, I order you to never ever say those kinds of silly things ever again. Are we clear, pumpkin? Yes, your highness. Welcome home, princess. Who is that you have with you, princess? Oh, she's a very special friend. Hello. Hello, miss. Welcome to our home. Thank you, pumpkins. Going up to your room, princess? Why, yes, I am, pumpkin. I see. Be careful not to eat too many sweets or else you'll get a tummy ache. Is that so, pumpkin? Come on, let's go. I kind of think of, like, stopping here. So I like, want to do like the two games um, the stream now. Princess Princess, I have a big favor to ask of you. You do? What is it, pumpkin? You see, Princess, my tooth fell out this morning. And I really want to get a coin from the tooth fairy. Would you please put my tooth under my leaves? Me? Oh no, pumpkin. There's no way I'm going to touch your tooth. But Princess, I just want, to, I just want the tooth fairy to pay me a visit. Hmm. Quit it, pumpkin. I'm not touching your filthy tooth. Wait, I just had tooth. And besides, Mr. Pumpkin even asks you nicely and everything. Oh, is that so? Why don't you do it then, huh? Gladly. Don't worry, Mr. Pumpkin. I'll do it for you. 
Please, Mr. Pumpkin. <laughs> Please, Mr. Pumpkin, I do it for you. I'm so polite and kind. It's still inside my mouth. Just reach for it. Is this a horror? It's a horror game, yeah. It is a horror game. Alright, then say ah, uh, ah. Uh. Oh, look at me. I'm so much better than Plata. I got it. Just let me put it under your leaves. And it's all done. Oh, thank you, thank you, thank you, miss. You're welcome, pumpkin. I hope you can meet a tooth fairy tonight. Me too, thank you so much, miss. Are you too done yet? Uh, yes. Don't waste my time, I want to go play. I'm sorry, Flater. I love sunbathing. Sunbathing. The warm sunlight always makes me feel at home. Alright. We will do more tomorrow then of this game. I think it's a good place to stop. 